That is so nice. Okay, now I get why men like breast implants. It's a woman's discretion. If she wants them, get them. If she doesn't, don't get them. I think that breast implants are unnecessary unless you're a cancer survivor and you want that form back. I have a friend who got breast implants and one popped. Oh God. I don't think it's any different than, you know, putting on makeup or, you know, changing the way you do your hair. I imagine that they feel either like jellyfish or balloons filled with pudding. Well, I'm excited to feel them. Yeah, the bigger the better, right? Whoa. Whoa. Oh, I didn't expect it to be like... Watery. Yeah. Doesn't have any give the way a boob does. A normal boob does. It's more like tension. I feel like I need to like compare. I'm not gonna touch my boob. Now this doesn't feel like a boob, I don't... Wait, does this whole thing go in there? It's like a complete built-in stress balloon. Like, I do not have You just hold them when you're stressed. Yeah, you're just like, oh, I'm having a bad day. <laughs> this is like a waterbed boob. It's a little waterbed for a mouse. But look, see if it rested on me, it's like, that doesn't really. But it has skin on top, so you have to think of like this. Like here, put it on okay. your shirt. Do you think it floats? <laughs> What if she's super buoyant in water? Right, this could, these could save lives. <laughs> that one is cute. That is good. This is a silky breast. One thing I like to do a lot is to like squeeze through really tight doors. Right, right. And then like, what if like I had a titty and like it could flatten with me and I could just shimmy? This looks like Purell in a plastic bag. <laughs> the best part about that is like it snaps right back. Fake boobs are often just like floating. But if this feels like it would be more natural because it's like slumpy. Why do you have to put it on your boob every time? This feels like an 80 year old woman's breast. <laughs> you know when they say like pancake nipple? They all just feel like pool toys and I can't imagine just putting that in your body. If you just like cut the skin, yes. like a little like a uh, titty tuck, I think like it would be better. This titty is so flat, it's like pizza. I'm not super far off with balloon full of pudding. <laughs> I don't even know what I would do. And jogging wait, with these? Wait, wait. That actually feels it's real. Tighter. In your body, this would probably be like a C if you yeah. had nothing else. They were fairly soft and yeah, I, realistic. They're heavy. Yeah. I would be nervous. You'd have to get like an extra sports bra for that. And I was also surprised that all three were so different. Mm -hmm. I'd like to know, you know, why you would gravitate towards one over the other. Don't let society pressure you to change who you are because, you know, who you are is pretty, pretty cool. Oh my God, what happens if you get oh, stabbed in your breast? That could actually save you though. If it pops the boob before it, it gets, gets to your, your heart, heart Shit, now I want breast implants. So I can like, in case I get stabbed. It's a safety precaution. It really is. And then like, what if like they stab you and like, and then it just project out? Oh my saline? God, can we fill them with like pepper spray? 